Chapter 10 and the last chapter, Cochineer and the Form Design. What is the definition of Cochineer? A Cochineer is a formalized set of questions or structured set of questions for obtaining information from respondents. Questionnaire objectives. We have got here three objectives. Number one, it translates the information needed to a set of specific questions to be answered by respondents. Very easy. Number two, it must motivate and encourage a respondent to be involved, cooperate, and complete the interview. Number three, it should minimize error. These are the three objectives of questionnaires. Here we have got main steps. But of course, we are not going to cover all of them. Step number one, specify information. A. Ensure the information obtained covers all the components of the problem, such as questions, hypotheses, and information. B. Have clear idea of the target population. Step number two, type of interviewing method. The researcher must review the type of interviewing methods. And the type of interviewing methods depending on the data required. Step number two, effect of interviewing method on questionnaire design. Number one, male questionnaire, which means the questionnaire is sent to the respondent via mail. A questionnaire is made asking respondent to rank 10 department stores according to their preference, starting from 1 to 10. This means the, respond the respondent is provided with a list of 10 department stores, asking him to rank them according to their preference. Number one, it would be the most preferred department store. Number 10, it means the lowest preferred department store. Step number two, effect of interviewing method on questionnaire design. Telephone questionnaire. After reading the department store's name, ask respondent, to read them in terms of their preference by using a 10 rating scale as follows. When donates not so preferred and the 10 donates greatly preferred. Therefore, the respondent will select his choice between 1 and 10. The interviewer reads one store at a time and the respondent are asked to indicate his preference. As follows, Nordstorm
not so preferred it is one greatly preferred it is ten and the respondent has to select only one of those ten grades from one to ten assume we'll select four Mrs. He may select seven. Walmart may select five. Number three, personal cochineer. A respondent is given ten cards. Then the interviewer asks the respondent to read them twice. And after that, also the interviewer will ask the respondent to pick up the card he prefers most, which includes the department store he prefers most, and so on until he reaches number 10. Step number three, individual questions content is the questions necessary questions with no satisfactory use should be eliminated from the questionnaire. Step three, individual questions content. Are several questions needed instead of one? Sometimes several questions are needed to obtain the required information in an, an ambiguous manner. Consider the question. Do you think Coke is a tasty and refreshing soft drink? It is incorrect because it includes two qualities, tasty and refreshing. Such a question is called a double parallel question because two or more questions are combined into one. To obtain the required information, two distinct questions should be asked. Do you think Coke is a tasty soft drink? And do you think Coke is a refreshing soft drink? That is the right question. The steps in the questionnaire design process are interrelated and the development of a questionnaire will involve some iteration and looping. Is it true or false? Of course it is true. All questions on a questionnaire should contribute to the information needed or serve some specific purpose. True or false? The answer is True. Step number four, choosing question structure or unstructured questions. We start with unstructured questions. They are open-ended questions. The answer will be in the respondent's words. Examples are what is your occupation who is your favorite actor which one is your favorite brand name and so on. number two structure the questions a specify a set of responses alternatives it may be mcq dichotomous or skill
Number one, MCQ. The researcher provides a choice of answers and the respondents are asked to select one or more of alternatives given. Example, do you intend to buy a new car within the next six months? We have got here many a choice of answers. You select the one that suits you. Definitely will not buy, probably will not buy, undecided, probably will buy, definitely will buy, others please, please specify. Another one, the Cotmas question. Two responses only, yes or no. And often supplemented by, I don't know, or none, or both. Example, do you intend to buy a new car within the next six months? Yes or no? Or I do not know. Choosing a question structure, scales. Do you intend to buy a new car within the next six months? That is the scale from one to five, whatever. Definitely will not buy, it is one. Probably will not buy, that is two. Undecided, three. Probably will buy, definitely will buy. And in the middle three is unsighted. Sensitive topics should be placed at the beginning of the questionnaire to get the difficult questions over with. True or false? The right answer is false. The Cotmas questions cannot have neutral alternatives such as don't know or no opinion. Is it true or false? The answer is false. Opening question should be used to get at the purpose of the questionnaire quickly. It is also false. Step 5, choosing question wording. A defines the issue. Choosing question wording. A defines the issue in terms of six W's. They are who, what, when, where, why, we. Example. Which brand of shampoo do you use? Incorrect. The right one is which brand or brands of shampoo have you personally used at home during the last month? In case of more than one brand, please list all the brands that apply. It is correct. Step number five and the final step, choosing question wording B. Use ordinary words. We'll give only an example. <coughs> Do you think the distribution of soft drinks is adequate in correct wording. Do you think soft drinks are readily available when you want to buy them? It is the right wording. By now, we have finished our lectures. Wish you all 
good luck.